Just a few days ago, we have reached a political agreement on the EU Air Act. What does that mean? First, we now have a model of governance for AI based on risk stemming from the interaction of tech with individual rights or with important values in society. That is a novel approach, which we think brings balance between targeted regulation of what matters, ensuring trust of citizens in the technology they interact with, and the need to keep the rest of AI free from regulation to encourage innovation and ensure growth. Secondly, we are introducing a governance framework, spearheaded by an AI office at European level, which will be ensuring the enforcement of the rules for impactful AI models for cross-border cases and also guarantee uniformity, coherence of application of the law across the 27 member states. The AI Act brings clarity to the market, standards that can guide investors, developers, and deployers of nav and navigating the fascinating evolution of AI in ethical, trustworthy fashion. It benefits our citizens, it benefits our societies and democracies, and it benefits our industries.